Dude, it took like some time, but we just got the new uh, bride. We got the installed. seat in. Yeah. Finally, it took a took a minute. I mean, not a whole minute, but. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what we're all about? Horse kids. Oh. That's my cousin. Oh. I have to take this one out, but it's being a real bitch. So there's four that you have to take off, I think. Yes. Make sure you lift your car to do it. Why? Because... Someone wants to buy this seat for $300. It's yours. It's a relic. Oh, we should probably so clean this. <laughs> yeah, but now's the time to clean it. <laughs> Washington Lottery. From 19... 19 what the fuck? 84. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> that car's not even that old! <laughs> I was... <laughs> somebody had this... Had that ticket for 10 years and then lost it in this car. <laughs> no, that's actually... Uh, I had that for a bookmark. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah, the hardest part about changing the racing seat is uh, taking your wheel off. Dude, so you should put like a short ram air take on that yeah, with like a K&N yeah, filter. Yeah, Soup up the shot back. Just, you know? <laughs> When you got your seat out, it's a good time to uh, vacuum the inside of your car. Uh, and also, using a shop vac is always good for another five horsepower. These them new boys. All right, so DJ left a while ago, and I was here doing it all, and I just finished. And that was probably the hardest thing I've done to this car. Taking out the diff was easier than doing this fucking wacky ass shit. Bolts broke and I had to jerry rig everything. And I don't know, it's sturdy, feels good, I look good. All right, so I'm on my way to pick up a passenger side bride seat so that when I'm sliding around, my girlfriend doesn't fall out of her chair. I got my two stock ones here because the dude said it would he would give it to me cheaper if I gave him my stock seats. So I said okay, because I don't need them. So about the engine I was going to go buy, I ended up not buying it because it looked like a piece of shit when I got there. Also, a couple people noticed that I put my car in Craigslist, but it's not for sale or anything. It's just uh, I'm trying to trade it for a coupe. I want to do something for getting a thousand subscribers. And I was thinking about giving away those old rims that were on it on the car first when I first bought it. Because I put them on Craigslist and no one wanted to buy them, so... I guess... If someone's around Seattle and wants to come meet me and have them for free, then... Then I think I'm going to buy new rims. I'm trying to sell the Rotas because they're kind of ugly, I think, I guess. I'm going to keep looking for an SR, like a better one. <laughs> Two forty now, and I got the passenger seat out because the guy wanted the trade for it. So yeah, it's weird in here without a passenger seat. I don't think you guys have seen this seat in here yet. I'm on the way to my girlfriend's house right now. Maybe we'll do some skids. Hello, oh, man. Hello. How's it going? Good. How are you? Good. Uh, you got anything to say? Yeah, I didn't. I didn't mean to do that. No, you mean you didn't see me behind you when you meant to do that. I don't. It's kind of crazy in the rain. No, I know. It's fun to do that in the rain, but you can't do that. Yeah, I understand. Okay. Got your license, registration, and insurance card on you? Yeah. Alright, so right before I got pulled over there, oh, I guess I didn't see the cop. Fat skid right out of my driveway onto the road. And he just pulled me over instantly. Dumbass and drift in front of cops. <laughs> really smart.